Everybody's just getting that cork, that pop cork. Popping that sound, that rattle. Voodoo shrimp on it. I haven't fished out here in forever, so not really knowing what to expect today, but the weather is it's cool. Gonna work in this cork. Also throwing some bite and fight angler. Throwing the cork with the voodoo shrimp, woody cork, and tossing some bite and fat ang bite and fight angler today. Let's see if we hook up. It's a beautiful day. Overcast, nice overcast. We've the water level is still really high from Hurricane Sally, and then right after Sally, we had Tropical Depression Beta, which that pushed the water level a little higher. So, about still about foot and a half to two feet higher than normal. So, typically, this area that we're in. It's two feet here. This area that you're in is probably like only a matter of inches. On an average tide, you might get maybe six inches, but be able to use our drive today. Now, when you have the high tide like this, it pushes a lot of bait in the grass, pushes a lot of reds in the grass. So it might be a little tricky to try to hook up today, but we're gonna give it our best. fish. Nope, there's no speck. Ugh, I thought it was a needlefish because he started swimming with it right on top. <laughs> Little specky. Voodoo shrimp picking up where it left off, unfortunately. On a baby. Oh, we'll take her. Get that skunk out of the boat. Always a good sign. See nothing, no fish though, nothing pumping, nothing jumping. A mullet here or there. That's it. Get this guy out of here. So like people will say, oh man, you can't throw a cork. It's only it's only like two feet water. You can't throw a cork in a shallow water, man. Yes you can. I caught a uh and they're like, oh you can't I'm charging for flounder, you can't catch flounder with a cork. Yes you can. Caught a 20 inch flounder, two and a half feet of water with a two foot leader on it. Uh, no, just a little slip cork. They were fishing, well, it might have been a crappie cork. Not that guy. Ooh, that's a flounder. Oh, that's a flounder. Ooh. <clears throat> Oh, that's a good flounder. Uh, flounder. Little flounder on the cork, and we were just talking about it. Voodoo shrimp and cork. He is still very green. Caught him about a foot and a half. Dang it. Caught him about a foot and a half of water two foot leader so they're liking this voodoo shrimp this morning so far See this guy right here nice looking fish right on the top of the mouth came right out oh my goodness Seventeen, nope, barely touching eighteen. Barely touching eighteen flounder, eighteen inch flounder. We just just got out here. Catch a few times on this grass line. Hot zone. Hold on, hold on. It might be grass. I might just have grass, but let's see. I like the way this wind looks like it's gonna push a little current, so. Hoping there'll be a flounder over here. 
Nope. God dang it. I knew it was gr Oh no, it was a crab probably. Yep. Pull your tail off. Yep. See, cause I could have... Nah, probably a crab. But it could have been a flounder. There it goes. There it goes. Oh! That was a fish. God dang it. That's got to be crabs, man. Same thing, bro. They're going through all my lures, man. Same thing. Look at that. Same spot, too. Little, you got two hands. You got two pinches full now. Let's see. Let's go. Haymaker. Real strong garlic scent. Uh. Yep, it's a nice flounder. Uh. Uh. Oh my goodness, gosh, Lee, he's not ready. We're gonna make him ready though. Oh, missed it again. Every time you see that net, he wants to dart back down. Oh my God, I am so wet now. <laughs> I am so wet. All I was doing was swimming it back to me and then just came direct halt. This guy's on. Well, this guy here is this a gorgeous fish. Gorgeous fish. So got him on. Oh look at that. Won't even hook. He was not even hooked. It was just in his mouth and his mouth was closed. Got him on that. Hey maker. I got so lucky with that guy. Let's see what this guy's at. Oh yeah. 19 and a half. 19 and a half. Bebba boy. Roar! Flounder. <laughs> 19 and a half for a good cause for celebration. Almost got 20. 20 is my, my bench, my personal benchmark. Let me know if I'm having a good day. But you know what? That's two flounders today. Little dink speck. Had a few hits. Saw red tailing back there. It was an undersized guy. And really just moved in here hoping to get a red. But. All right, just my battery died on me. Just caught this little guy right here. Got him on a, just swimming this knock and tail lure. I'm on that knock and tail. Look, he's gonna be undersized, but I measure him anyway. Let's see. Nope. <laughs> I got a slot. 20 and a half. Man, they've been eluding me today. 20 and a half. I take it back. 
20 and three quarters. 20 and three quarters right here. That's gonna, it's gonna make them. What'd you get it on? Uh, popping cord, wood is popping cord. Oh, no, no, no. There it is right here. Eric just got Texas Slam today. Yes, sir. On the woody cork. On the woody. What'd you, what'd you, what'd you get? Uh, what's your reds? Uh, 221s and a half. Uh, 17 and a half inch flounder. And uh, what was that? In spec? 18 inch spec. 18 inch spec? Yep. 16 inch spec. 16 inch. Yep. When he gets home, by the time he gets home, it's going to be 20 inch spec. That's how he, <laughs> anybody ask him. First time using a woody cork, and he got a Texas Slam today. Yes, sir. I'm just saying, if you don't believe... A slam well, on the cork, man. A slam on the cork. If you don't believe, well, then, you know, when y'all see me, I got, got myself a nice a nice flounder on the cork today as well. Yes, sir. All right, so that's going to do it today. Myself and Eric, we came out, hit Galveston, the West Bay area. Did a little fishing around the marsh area. Tide has been very high. It just started to go down the last few days. It's been real high because of Tropical Storm Beta. But we were able to get into a few fish. Eric caught his first time, Eric's first time out here using a woody cork, and he caught a Texas Slam. I couldn't be happier for him. It's always fun when you see somebody that purchased something because simply because you're using it, and they see you having success, and it's great to watch somebody come out and have some of the same success that you have had using something like a like a woody cork but anyway thanks for coming back don't forget to like comment subscribe and share and hopefully next time you'll catch me hooking up thanks <laughs>